How to uninstall app updates on iPhone? Have you ever updated an app on your iPhone only to find that the new version isn't quite what you expected? Maybe it's buggy, or perhaps the new features just aren't for you. Whatever the reason, you might be wondering how to uninstall those app updates and go back to a previous version. First, let's clarify that you can't d directly uninstall app updates on your iPhone using the device alone. However, there are a few methods you can use to achieve this. One of the most recommended methods involves using a third-party software called AnyTrans. Here's how you can do it. Download and install AnyTrans on your computer. Connect your iPhone to the computer. Open AnyTrans, click on the apps icon, and manage your apps. Choose the app you want to downgrade, go to the app downloader section, and select the older version of the app you want to install. Sign in with your Apple ID to download the older version and then install it on your iPhone. Another method you can use is through iTunes, but this only works if you haven't updated to iTunes 12.7 or later. Here's what you need to do. Uninstall the updated app on your iPhone. Launch iTunes on your computer and connect your iPhone via USB cable. Tap on the device icon in the upper left corner, then choose Apps on the left. Find the app version you want to install and press the Install button. Sync your iPhone with iTunes to get the old version back. If you're using iTunes 12.7 or later, the Apps tab is no longer available, so you'll need to use AnyTrans or another similar tool. It's also worth noting that if you have a backup of your apps through iTunes, you can restore the older version from that backup. Here's how. Delete the app whose update you want to undo on your iPhone. Connect your iPhone to your computer and launch iTunes. Click on the device icon, then the Apps tab. Choose the app you want to restore. Click Install, and then Sync to transfer it back to your iPhone. These methods give you the flexibility to manage your app updates and go back to versions that work better for you. So, the next time you're not happy with an app update, you know exactly what to do.